Hey everybody, Crypto Mentor 99 How you doing? So today's crypto conversation, it was awesome. It was short, but it was awesome. Let me break it down for you. So once a week, I take my father-in-law out for breakfast. Him and my mother-in-law live here in town. And they're in an assisted living, like retirement home. And I like to get him out, you know, he's old, older. And we go to this one breakfast place that we've been going to, I don't know, the last two or three months or so. And we either go on Thursday or Friday, but because of Thanksgiving this weekend, which is tomorrow, I did it today, Wednesday, November 27th. So we get there and there's a new waiter that waits on me. And I could tell he's probably a college uh, man from college, maybe home on break, trying to make a couple extra bucks. And that's exactly what it turned out to be. So I strike up a conversation with him and he was a, a, a senior and, you know, he wanted to graduate and, you know, get on with his life and get a job. And so I, I'm talking to my father-in-law and he keeps on walking by. I'm like, I gotta, I gotta tell him about cryptocurrency or ask him a few questions. And then we're done eating. I get the bill you know, tipped them, and my father-in-law wanted to drink some more coffee, and he came by the table. I'm like, dude, and I just kind of encouraged him, you know, after he gets his degree, just to work hard and stay focused, and, and then I said, the second thing you need to do, and he, and he was really attentive, you know, like soaking up what appeared to be every word that I said, and I said, I kind of grabbed his arm, and I'm like, you got to learn about cryptocurrency. And he's like, I kind of know a little bit about it. I'm like, great, tell me about it. And he's like, well, you know, like there's like Bitcoin. And I don't know if he said Litecoin, but he said Ethereum. And he's like, one of my friends, you know, was like trading and he ended up buying a house. I'm like, dude, that could be you. I said, I'm not necessarily talking about trading per se. But I said, you're a young guy. I said, I got my son who's about your age, maybe a little older. Um, interested in cryptocurrency a couple years ago, and he's just, you know, really, really doing good with it. And I just said, just start to learn about it. And I said, I'm not, you know, the sharpest knife in the drawer, the brightest bulb in the bunch, but I said, I've got a YouTube channel, Crypto Mentor 99 and he wrote it down. I said, take a look at it this weekend. Um... But, you know, I said, if there's anything I can do for you, let me know. So he enjoyed that. And I wonder, he may even watch this video in the next day or two. I have no idea. But if you are, I didn't catch your name, but you're going to go far in life and you got to learn about cryptocurrencies. It's plural, not cryptocurrency, cryptocurrencies. And if I can do anything, let me know. But anyhow... That's the crypto conversation that I had today, which is somewhat representative of every other crypto conversation I have. I just ask questions. Have you ever heard of Bitcoin? Do you know what blockchain is? Do you care about blockchain? Do you care that, uh, you know, your fiat money is going, you know, decreasing in value? I just ask questions. I don't act like an expert. Why? Because I'm not an expert, but I could ask lots, lots of questions. So anyhow... Today's crypto conversation, it was short, sweet, and simple, but I think it was impactful, and it just motivated me to come home and want to learn more, ask more questions, and get more people involved over the Thanksgiving weekend. Anyhow, Crypto Mentor 99, you know I love you, and thanks for being part of my crypto family. See you later. Bye-bye.